Hey guys, just Greg here and welcome to Animal Crossing. So this is day five or day six and today I am just going to chop some wood, do my daily routines and I don't know, uh, we'll see what happens and if something interesting happens then I guess I'll show you. Uh, as you can see I have Bo as one of my villagers and I really really love Bo. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna chop some trees and uh, let's see. So I was basically checking the trees for wasps, that's uh, what I do, it's uh, with a net, just to make sure that if there's a wasp nest, I can catch them and not get stung, that's the idea behind my approach of this. So I got some money, and everything was going great, I was really having a, a good time, uh, until uh, this happened. I accidentally started shaking the tree again. I wanted to catch them. I was ready to catch them, but I accidentally looked at the tree and pressed A and well, my face is all ruined now. <laughs> that was uh, that was great. So I was uh, getting more money and again I found a wasp nest and this time I got it right. This time I got it right. <laughs> That's the original idea of my uh, shaking the trees with a net in hand. <laughs> it's better than just uh, cutting wood and then getting stung, you know? <laughs> so here I was just walking around, just going. Uh, I basically did all my wood for the day and I have like 40 or 50 or maybe even 60 trees. And I was kind of done with it. I didn't even want to collect it. I didn't want to continue. I was just done with it. <laughs> so here I just am um, trying to find my money rock. And I found my money rock. And I saw a centipede, but I already catch them. And I don't need 99 more to get a dollar pede. So, you know. it was. It's always good to have a money rock. Um, yeah, and it, uh, it, was a, it was a money rock. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to say more about that. It's a money rock. And then uh, some bamboo, but basically that was uh, it. So then I started to design my flag. I have a flag behind me, if you remember some of my videos where I don't have a green screen. Uh, this is a flag that I made for my book. Um, and I basically tried to make the flag as well. Okay, let's see. Yes, 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 I do. I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Yes. Yes. Yes, I do. I have a great flag and I worked hard on it. I do. Come on, Isabel. You're gonna love it. You see? You see? It's beautiful and I'm not even talking about the Just Greg logo because that took a long while well, to make as well. So, uh, let's see how this will look. Oh god. Oh, it's perfect! I was like, what? Why are you scared? But it's perfect in every way. Okay. Yeah. Nah, that's fine. Okay. Well, let's actually take a look at how the flag looks. Ah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you know, at least I got this finished now, but uh, the flag, um, yeah, it uh, it doesn't look as I hoped. Bye, Sonic. Let me check the airport real quick. Maybe the airport looks better. I don't know. This probably looks the same. Oh man. Hey, Mac. Yeah. It's fine. It's not that bad. It's just it looks weird for some reason. I don't know why. I really don't know why it looks so weird. It's just yeah. I I worked hard on it. It might yeah, maybe it's the pixelation and stuff like that. I'll just go home and you know, check my stuff. And it's an olive flounder, an olive flounder. They, they are like, what, 2k maybe worth? So that's not bad. Oh, is this a legendary fish? Are you legendary? 
No, it's a, uh, it's, it's a Lisa C plus. Oh, I'm getting a little bit tired of these fish. So I was uh, continuing looking around uh, at this point and uh, I was just trying to find ore fish and stuff. But um, yeah, I, I pulled out too quickly. And here I have another sea bass. God, great, great, great. That's great. Sea basses are great. So it is 7.33 and I just wanted to play a little bit more. I could, I stopped playing because I was uh, done with the sea basses, but uh, you know, maybe, maybe we'll have some luck at random islands and stuff like that. So we'll see a little bit. Just gonna get my uh, nook miles in a bit and we'll fly off. And uh, hopefully we find Tarantula Island. So, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yes, I want to fly. I have Nook Miles. And I want to find Tarantula Island. Let's go to Tarantula Island, Orville. And if not, then I have... Uh, I guess I'll have to make my own Tarantula Island. Which is basically just cutting everything down. Um, so, no other animal spawns. So... We'll see. So at this point, I tried to go to a random island and I found, uh, unfortunately, a pond island, uh, which I realized very quickly once I started talking to this dodo. W once I arrived, I saw the placement of the tree and the flower in the distance and I already knew this is going to be a pond uh, map. So I decided, you know what, maybe I should just try to fish for some koi. Uh, which are my favorite fish, by the way. Um, I didn't even know that they belong to the carp family uh, until this game. <laughs> Blathers from the museum, uh, where you give your animals to, your fish and your bugs. Um, he basically explains what they are, and I was very surprised. So I really liked that I learned something new. And I caught a normal carp, which is not what I wanted. So I was fishing around for a little bit more and I found a red snapper, which is really great. I really like uh, how some of the fish look in this game. So the red snapper was a, was, a, was a great catch for me. And I was just running around trying to find koi's or maybe even legendaries. But uh, yeah, it, uh, it wasn't as, as, as interesting as I hoped it was. So here yeah, I'm just trying to fish for some koi. And I pulled out. <laughs> I pulled out too quickly. That's what she said. That's my problem with this game. I always tend to pull out a little bit too quickly. Uh, or sometimes very late. So, and we got ourselves a... A carp. God damn it. <laughs> So, after a while, I was kind of sick and tired of fishing, so I decided to uh, decimate the entire place and hope for a tarantula spawn. This way, I'm uh, uh, yeeting all the beetles and all the other non-tarantula uh, animals. I did, uh, I did manage to catch a few uh, kois uh, beforehand, which was really great, but I wanted some tarantulas because tarantulas are around 8,000 uh, bells each. Which is great, and here I found one. I uh, managed to aggro him, and I got him. And uh, at least <laughs> I got him trapped, and I only got him. So yeah, those uh, animals, I, I really disliked them. I caught a few, uh, which is great for money, because I need money uh, to upgrade my house further. Because otherwise Tom Nook uh, is going to uh, bust my kneecaps, which obviously you want to keep your kneecaps. So you need to listen to the raccoon and uh, give, give him his money. So here I started fishing again because I was a dummy. I cut down all the trees. Luckily I got a koi. But my net broke and I didn't have any tree branches anymore. So I had to go back to fishing. So let's just sell all my stuff. Ah, koi, yeah. I want to keep a koi and a red snapper. Because I want them in my house. And yeah. How much is this gonna bring uh, bring to the table? Oh, 
Okay, 100,000. That's not bad. That's not bad. At least all the money I can uh, give to your father now, Timmy and Tommy. God damn it, I need my kneecaps. So, 304,000 uh, bells. And I'm just gonna use all that. And now I only have to pay 400,000, which is still a lot. But it's less than I had to pay just a few seconds ago. So, I guess that's a, that's a plus sign. And now I just have to find some tarantulas and some other things. And, uh, well, Mac, Mac looks sexy as always. I got some Nook Miles, so let's just random island again. Let's hope for the best this time. So, yeah, I found this weird island. I have no idea what it was at this time. I, I never saw this before. Uh, so, yeah, I just decided, you know what, I should start recording this because this looks interesting. Uh, even though it doesn't look interesting to see a weird plateaued island with only like five rocks in the middle but I thought you know what this should probably be something interesting maybe it's a lot of centipedes or something uh, as you can see I'm really great at you know making holes in the ground <laughs> so I decided you know what we're just gonna check if these rocks are any interest or not and there you go I found a money rock and funny enough, all of these rocks were money rocks. And I didn't know that at the time. I thought, well, maybe I was lucky with just this rock. But apparently all of them are. And this is one of the islands that I have never been before. And I really do appreciate it. I decided to eat a pear and maybe destroy one of the rocks to see if there's money hidden inside. But it's just stone. So nothing special about that. And I wanted to confirm are all these rocks money rocks and yes yes they are this is probably one of my favorite islands i hope to come back here soon because it's free money and it's easy money so i decided you know what i just want to grab everything uh all the weeds every flower and just bring it home back to me uh, I wanted to try to see if this could be a tarantula island, but no animals spawned. There we go. There we go. There we go. And wrapping up for tonight. Hey, so it's a little bit later now and uh, I was on Reddit and I saw that someone was opening their island and they had a lot of different fruits. I only have a pear and an apple. So they have, I think, peaches. Yes. Yeah, yeah. It's peaches they have. So I hope to get some peaches with this. Okay. This is an interesting island. Uh, they have apples. I saw peaches. So, yeah. I've never visited someone's island before, so this is, like, brand new territory. Oh, look, it's another person. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's great. Um, yeah. Hello! Hello, everyone! So, this is your island, right? Uh, please close the window. I, okay, I can't do anything now. Uh, what? Did he... Did he just kick me from the island? Really? Huh? Okay, uh... I have no idea what I'm looking at right now, what the hell? Passenger shell grabbing crybaby baby blue arriving from a airport. Oh, is there someone else joining from Reddit? Oh, seriously? Oh, but he put his he put his island code on on reddit. Oh, man Don't tell me I have to sit through this like a billion times. Oh God. No. Oh God jeez. this is gonna take a long time then Oh Well, I guess we'll have to wait and <laughs> see Let me check. Oh, no Okay, so that's baby blue. Hello! 
No, thank you for your cherry. I really appreciate it. No, well, you can have a pear for me. Here, have a pear. I really want you to have it. There. All right, wait, wait, stop. Why did she go away? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tim's balls. <laughs> no, we're from penis. Yep. Tim's balls arriving from penis. That's, that's fantastic. So yeah, I decided to uh, play for a little bit longer. Uh, it was a lot of fun at the island. I got cherries, I got oranges, and I got peaches. People were really, really nice. And yeah, so I want to get rid of some of my apple trees here. And I think I might place some of the peaches there or oranges. Uh, but I don't really know. I just want to clear this out a little bit because I feel like my uh, or orchard is getting a little bit too close to home and a little bit too big. I don't like that. When I end the game, I literally do this every single time. I know it's maybe childish, but it's a routine and I really like it. And I don't know if anyone else does this, uh, but I do. I, I, di I did this since day one from the game. Uh, and I really, really don't know why I keep doing this. I could just save outside, but I, I don't know. I just want my villager to sleep when I go to sleep, if that makes sense. It's stupid. If you play Animal Crossing, uh, let me know in the comment section down below. Do you do this too, or am I really just that weird for doing this? So, let me just... Oh, I guess we'll have to get a wand uh, stick. And I'll hold it. And then change into my... Oh, no. That's not my pajamas. Change into my pajamas. This is my pajamas and I wear this all the time. Oh, God damn it. D-pad down in your own house. I keep doing it to get rid of my uh, item. But, oh, God. I keep forgetting that you can only do that when you're outside. So I still have to get used to it. So, yeah, that was a, a, fun, a fun night. I played a little bit longer than I should. It's nearly 2 a.m. So it's probably time for me to head the sack. Go to bed, go to sleep, and maybe tomorrow will be an interesting day. Uh, I don't know if anyone will find this interesting to watch or not, but if you do, uh, leave a like and let me know in the comment section down below. Anyways, guys, just Greg signing out. Real love you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>